So the next tip we are going to look at is the melody. Now the melody is the most important. I cannot overemphasize how important the melody is. So never sacrifice your melody. I mean, we're trying to develop feel, but at the same time, you should always know where your melody is. So that's what we're going to do today. All right. So we are going to use the same song that we started out with. Have you been to Jesus for the cleansing power? All right, so the melody of the first line says, All right. With your right hand, now your left hand can harmonize. All right, see that? So the left hand pretty much can play any note within the E flat because we're in E flat. The left hand can pretty much play any note within the E flat scale. All right, so remember our melody is. Now the left hand can play any note. depends on how you want to play it. it it doesn't matter there's no set way of playing it and um, use all your fingers so you're gonna practice that that just that first line and remember now we're trying to develop feel so you play it how you feel all right and be light on the keys light on the keys stay on top of your notes and be light Keep on top of your notes, remember. You can just add what you want. All right, so now I'm adding all sort of things, just how I'm feeling because you want to develop that feel. So just practice like that. So I go out of my melody right there, but it doesn't matter because that's how I'm feeling. So don't feel like you're in a box. You can do just about anything once you stay within the scale and you know where your actual melody is. All right? So... Next line now, are you wash? Melody. That's the next line. All right, so we have a lot of broken chords there. So we start out with block. Six. All right, so. so remember now, you're playing for yourself. You're not necessarily on a metronome, on a timing. You're playing for yourself. So, six. Use that. You see that? I actually put in two movements right there. So it's three. Still on your melody. All right. 
and harmonizing with your left hand. Six, two, five, one, four. This chord here. All right, and you're probably wondering what is happening here. But before we go to, let's go back. Are uh, you wash? Six. So that's a broken chord right here. So hear the melody and then squeeze in that, that 13th, F13 right there. And then come to the 5. Uh -huh. Then we go into the 6. And do that. 6. chord again so what am i doing so this is where the bass is so i hold a chord actually in my left hand the a i hold the the a major with my left hand and then i hold c minor in my right hand 